guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Mason, also Mason Lee down below. And if you haven't already, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and my social medias are linked down below. So give that a follow. We are almost at a thousand followers on Instagram. Thank you guys so much. And I also have a blog, livinglivevirtually.com. And as always, for my favorite videos, there's a like a coordinating blog post with links. So go check that out. That is linked down below. And yeah, this video, I'll be sharing my June favorites, things that are new to me, things that are new that I have been loving. So let's get into it. So first up is this Hollister sweatshirt. It's like these white zip ups I've always been wearing. It's a hoodie, it has these cute little pockets. It's like a little crop I'm wearing pajama shorts. But I had been on the search for so long for like a cute cropped hoodie. And I was literally checking every single website and then somehow I came across this and it was like the perfect price, the perfect fit, and it was just perfect. Like the brandy ones are cute, but they're only in like a small. And I got this in like a medium, which I'm normally, I normally get a large for like length. So if you're tall, like this is also perfect. Cause I normally get large for sleeve length, crop length, cause I, it will get super cropped cause like my sizing. This is perfect. If you're especially tall, like highly suggest this. You can buy your normal size. Like I'm normally a medium, but I always buy larges just because of the way stuff fits. So highly suggest it. It's a great price. I think it was like $20, somewhere around that area, maybe 30. Pretty reasonable for like a high quality sweatshirt. It's super like perfect. I brought it to the beach. It's like literally perfect for summer. You've probably seen me wear it. It looks really good with these like Urban Outfitters tank tops that I wear all the time. I know it just like literally matches everything. It's like the perfect baggy cropped fit. So it's like perfect. It just, I had been looking for one for so long. Everybody has them. Everybody has the brandy one. I was like, I just don't want that. And it's not like super cropped also. But yeah. Okay, next up on my list is these Walmart tank tops. If you haven't already, check out my blog post where I tell you how I made them, which you'll find it when I link down my other blog post. So this is number one. It's cropped and then I cut a little slit in front. So it's like that trendy thing and it's like super soft this one's just wrinkled but it's just like white this one's kind of see-through so i know i'm sure this is a cover-up but you could also like tie-dye it or just get a different color i just got i only got two at first because i want to make sure i like them then i also got this navy ribbed one that i just cropped perfect for fourth of july literally blue matches everything i just wanted to start out really basic and i'm definitely going back because this was maybe six dollars total maybe seven but if that so highly suggest getting these check out my blog post to see how i did it if you guys want a video for more detail let me know i can do a video about different ways to style them so i definitely can do that and then next on my list is the tv show selling sunset and if you have not seen this literally go watch netflix right now watch it it might be just on normal tv i honestly don't know i watch on netflix and it's like, it's about the Oppenheim group in LA, which is like a realty group. And there are two brothers who are the brokers and then a ton of like tall, pretty girls who are the agents. And it's about them selling houses, their dating lives, and then the drama between the girls. It's just keeps you on your toes. It's such a good TV show. I like, see, there's two seasons out. Season three comes out August 7th. Go watch it now. It is like so good. And before you watch it, don't look on the girls' like social medias like as you're watching and stuff. I didn't do that because then like, I don't know, it gives stuff away, like who gets married, who's dating who, who has a baby, who's like doing this, who's doing what, like, so just don't do that so you know, so you're not, so you're like surprised. Literally go watch that now. And then this is an app that is new to me. I thought it costed money till I saw a TikTok where a girl was doing like free presets, like showing how to do like basic presets and stuff. And it is Lightroom. And since I found those presets, I've like kind of made my own or adjusted those and kind of made them all work together. And I love it, it's free. There are some things you can pay for to get like more additions, but for just basic editing, it's free. And if you guys want a video or just like a blog post of me with my presets, let me know, cause I will do that. Comment down below if you want that, cause I am obsessed with making presets. I probably make like one every day or every other day, or I like just edit photos for fun now because I'm obsessed with Lightroom. And last but not least is Spotify. I have got, I've had Spotify forever and then I got Spotify premium for Christmas, but like during the school year, I like didn't really make like playlists. I always had very basic like homework, workout, like friend music, like my friends and I have like some shared playlists with each other for certain like things we do. 
but lately I've been making a ton of playlists. So if that's, I think I can try to figure out how to link that down below. So go check that out. It's also, I think in my link tree on my Instagram, I'll try to link stuff down below. So go check that out. It's like, I've been working, but making some good playlists, trust me, go check them out. And let me know, comment down below your playlist or your Spotify username. We can be friends. I like stalking other people's Spotify's, like not gonna lie. Just to see like what music they're into. I'm never like a huge music person, but now I am. Cause if you know me, I'm not like really into like music. I don't like listen to music all the time, but now I do. Because I've just like learned how to, I figured out like more music so I can make more like curated playlists. You know what I mean? And that is it for my June favorites. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, my blog post is linked down below. Follow my social medias and give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe. I don't know which side it's on. Subscribe. And yeah, thank you guys for watching.